Welcome to our podcast, where we uncover the most important and interesting stories for you. In this episode, we'll discuss ISRO's simulation of space conditions for astronauts in Habitat 1 and what it entails. Indian Space Agency ISRO is creating Habitat 1 or HAB 1, which is its first ever analog mission in which space conditions are simulated to prepare astronauts before they go for real space missions. Scientists recently tested it for three weeks in the Himalayan mountain ranges of India's Union Territory of Ladakh. Speaking to the BBC, Gujarat-based firm Arka Space's architect Asta Kachajala said that the simulations help in identifying and addressing the issues that equipment and astronauts may face before space missions. Habitat 1 has been built using space-grade Teflon and is insulated with industrial-use foam. It has a bed, as well as a stowaway tray, which one can pull out and use like a workstation. There is storage space for keeping emergency kits, supplies, a toilet as well as a kitchenette for heating meals. The astronauts remained holed up in the simulation for three weeks. HAB-1 is designed keeping in mind that space is going to be very limited on the Moon or Mars. The astronaut will also have very limited water, so we designed a dry toilet. We also put in place a system for a proper disposal of waste and ensured that the habitat remained odor-free, said Kachajala. Kachajala is now holding talks with ISRO for constructing the country's first permanent simulation space facility in Ladakh. This is happening at a time when India is making preparations for sending its first astronauts into space. ISRO's Gaganyaan mission has decided to place its three astronauts for three days into low Earth orbit. The orbit is at an altitude of 400 kilometers. If everything happens as per the plan, ISRO will launch the mission next year. India is planning to set up the country's first space station by 2035 and send its first astronaut to the moon by 2040. Dozens of simulation missions are carried out by space programs of NASA, European Space Agency, Russia, China, and other countries. Meanwhile, two Indian astronauts were selected for the Gaganyaan mission and are receiving their training at NASA currently. Once we have our own simulation mission, we won't have to depend on foreign space agencies to train our astronauts, said Professor Subrat Sharma, Dean of Research Studies at Ladakh University. The university has collaborated with ISRO on the project. Speaking to BBC, Professor Sharma said that the experiment is being carried out in Ladakh because, from a geographical perspective, its rocky, barren landscape and soil have similarities with the material and rocks found on Mars and some parts of the lunar terrain, which make it ideal for space research. That's all from this podcast. Thanks for listening. We have many more such compelling episodes for you. Enjoy them. Do share your opinion in the comment box and subscribe to us for more.